the youthful days that we have are some of the best days of our lives, really, generally. So, like many people, I had a wonderful uh, experience as a child in Lagos. Lagos was created as a state when I was only four years old. In 1967, I went to schools in Sioux Lire, Sunnyfields Primary School, Batch Freeman High School, and then later to Bobby College. We went from one corner of Lagos to the other, from Mushin, Sioux Lire, Lagos Island, where my grandparents were, my paternal grandparents, uh, Oshudi, where my maternal grandmother's house was. I moved across Lagos extensively. My aunt and her husband lived in uh, Akoka, so I used to traverse from my grandmother's place in Oshudi to enter the Mulwe bus to Bariga, going through uh, Bagada to Elaje. I know. So, then, of course, going to swim at an uh, airport hotel in Ikeja. So, either we were going to play football or we to ride bicycles across. I saw National Theatre develop as a pool of sand when the reclamation was done. So, uh, we used to play football behind the Celestial Church, now a cellar behind the Apapa Oshu, the expressway, when there was no route there. I wanted to spend more time playing football. But school was made important and um, going abroad then really, we went on holidays abroad but I just didn't think I could live abroad. I didn't like the weather, it was too cold uh, and so even though my, some of my siblings went abroad, uh, I just refused to go and uh, I, I'm happy that I stayed here. So all my education was in Lagos and it was a very happy happy period of my life. Uh, unfortunately, those days are behind you now. And, uh, uh, but it was a very happy, happy experience growing up and living in Lagos and seeing Lagos evolve. That experience helped me in many respects when I became governor because I knew the state almost like the back of my hand. You know, and then growing up in a place like Ijesha, Aguda, Lawansi, uh, going to school in Yaba. So it was, very, it was a very helpful experience that one knew what one was managing. And decision making, understanding, choice making was clearer. It wasn't something abstract. It was very vivid. And uh, since it was well, now it's now 50 years. So a lot of time has passed. Irrespective of where you came from, the important thing was, did you feel Lagos at heart? Did you feel Lagos as your home? Did you feel Lagos as a place you could protect? Did you feel Lagos as a place you could contribute to? And all those who take those answers positively found a place where their full ambitions were met and realized successfully. <laughs>